Multiprocessing.process doesn't terminate after putting requests response.content to queue. I'm trying to run multiple API requests in parallel with multiprocessing.process and requests. I put URLs to parse into joinable queue instance and put back the content to the queue instance. I've noticed that putting response.content into the queue somehow prevents the process from terminating. Here's simplified example with just one process, Python 3.5. After running the code I get infinite loop terminates child process 1 true. Please help to understand why the process doesn't terminate after run function exits. Update, added print statement to show the loop terminates. Regarding why the process doesn't terminate itself, your function code is an infinite loop, so it doesn't ever return. Calling terminate signals the process to kill itself. As noted in the pipes and queues documentation, If a child process has put items on a queue, and it has not used joinable queue.cancel underscore join underscore thread, then that process will not terminate until all buffered items have been flushed to the pipe. This means that if you try joining that process you may get a deadlock unless you are sure that all items which have been put on the queue have been consumed, note that a queue created using a manager does not have this issue. If you switch over to a manager queue, then the process terminates successfully. It's a bit hard to figure this out based on the queue documentation, I struggled with the same problem. The key concept here is that before a producer thread terminates, it joins any queues that it has put data into, that join then blocks until the queue's background thread terminates, which only happens when the queue is empty. So basically, before your child process can exit, someone has to consume all the stuff it put into the queue. There is some documentation of the queue.cancel underscore join underscore thread function, which is supposed to circumvent this problem, but I couldn't get it to have any effect, maybe I'm not using it correctly. Here's an example modification you can make that should fix the issue, 